At 1 a.m. in the Twin Cities it was cloudy, it was 38 degrees, or 3 degrees Celsius. The dew point was 36. The relative humidity was 92%. The wind was southwest at 6 miles an hour. The pressure was 29.39 inches and rising. Around the metro, it was cloudy, and temperatures were between 37 and 39 degrees. Around the state, at Duluth, drizzle was falling, with a temperature of 38. It was cloudy, with a temperature of 40 at Rochester, 34 at St. Cloud, 34 at Brainerd, and 17 at International Falls. Across the Dakotas, snow was falling, and temperatures were between 11 and 14 degrees. In Iowa, it was cloudy. It was 40 at Des Moines, and 34 at Mason City. Around Wisconsin, skies ranged from mostly cloudy to cloudy. It was 46 at Madison. 52 at Milwaukee, and 42 at Eau Claire, once again at 1 a.m. in the Twin Cities. It was 38 degrees, under cloudy skies. Winds will strengthen late tonight in parts of southern Minnesota. Winds will increase to 30 to 35 miles per hour over much of southern Minnesota, and persist through midday Saturday. The strong winds and the cold air will act upon wet roads, to result in a rapid freeze on pavement. The combination of strong winds and icy patches will make for difficult driving conditions. Low pressure in northern Minnesota was bringing along a cold front. The front is expected to reach Wisconsin by sunrise Saturday. Freezing drizzle, snow and strong winds overnight will cause travel problems over portions of central and southern Minnesota. Light freezing drizzle will occur for a few hours early this morning across central and portions of southern Minnesota in the wake of a strong cold front. The freezing drizzle will transition to snow across west central into central Minnesota. Snow accumulations overnight are forecast to be an inch or less. The freezing drizzle will lead to very slippery roads and walkways. In addition, strong northwest winds to 35 miles per hour will produce periods of blowing snow across west central Minnesota that will significantly reduce visibility. Areas most susceptible to the blowing snow will be those west of the line from Long Prairie to Litchfield and Gillard. Finally, the combination of colder air and strong winds will cause dangerous wind chill readings from 15 below to 20 below zero Saturday morning across the region. Now for the National Weather Service forecast for the Twin Cities metropolitan area. Tonight, breezy, cloudy, a chance of rain in the evening, then a chance of rain and snow overnight. Lows around 20. South winds 10 to 15 miles an hour shifting to the southwest 15 to 25 miles an hour overnight. Chance of precipitation 40%. Saturday, breezy, mostly cloudy. Highs around 20. West winds 15 to 25 miles an hour. Saturday night, colder, mostly cloudy. Lows around 5. West winds 10 to 15 miles an hour. Sunday, partly cloudy. Highs around 15. West winds around 10 miles an hour. Sunday night, mostly clear. Lows around 5. West winds around 5 miles an hour. And now for the extended forecast. Monday and Monday night, partly cloudy. Highs around 15. Lows around 5. Tuesday and Tuesday night, partly cloudy. A 20% chance of snow. Highs in the mid-20s. Lows around 15. Wednesday and Wednesday night, partly cloudy. Highs in the mid-twenties. Lows around 5. Thursday through Friday, partly cloudy. Highs around 20. Lows around 10. Again, the forecast for the Twin Cities metropolitan area for tonight. Breezy, cloudy. A chance of rain in the evening, then a chance of rain and snow overnight. Lows around 20. South winds 10 to 15 miles an hour shifting to the southwest 15 to 25 miles an hour overnight. Chance of precipitation 40%. This is the Twin City Metropolitan Area Weather Radio Station, KC65, serving a portion of East Central Minnesota and West Central Wisconsin. We broadcast from the National Weather Service Forecast Office in Champaign, Minnesota on an assigned frequency of 162.55 MHz and transmit from the KFTP Television Tower in St. Paul. The current time is 1.07 a.m. Central Standard Time.